Hi guys, how are you guys today? I have a spring blush video, so I'm just gonna get started. Um, in regards to spring, so many people like wearing corally pink colors and just like softer pinks and a little bit of like bronzy colors. So I'm gonna get on started with the drugstore um, blushes that fall into that category. A great um, brand for drugstore blushes is e.l.f. and you can find e.l.f. at Target or at e.l.f.com and this is what it looks like and they run $3 a piece. Um, this is a color Pink Passion. This is more of a highlighter pink color but if you use like a fluffy brush and a light hand this is a really pretty color and it looks like that right there. So I really really like this color. Another um, color great for spring by e.l.f. is Candid Coral and it looks like this. It reminds me of Nars's Orgasm which I'll show you guys later but this is more of a true like orange coral. So it doesn't have any pink in it. It's right in my middle finger. Another drugstore blush that I really like for spring is this NYX Cream Blush. This is in the color Boho Chic. And since this is a cream blush, I feel like it's going to wear longer. And you can also wear it on your lips, which is really, really nice. And it looks like that. So it's really, really nice. And these run for about $7. And I got mine at Ulta. So um, the next blushes that I'm going to show you are more higher end. And I purchased all of mine at Sephora. Um, this one that I have is by the Brand Laroc. And it's called Tantalizer. And this is the only like bronzy color blush that I have. And this is actually like a bronzer, but I love to use it as a blush. And this one was only $7. I feel like this bronzer is never talked about here on YouTube. And I really, really like it. It's really pretty as a blush. And it's on my pinky. And it's really, really pretty. People are afraid of it. But once it goes on, it's really, really pretty. And like I said, this one is a small size. And this one is only $7 at Sephora. So definitely check it out. Another um, popular br blush for um, spring is by the brand NARS, and this is Orgasm. And then this one was $28, and it looks like that. So it's going to be like a corally pink color, and I'll swatch it on my thumb, and it looks like that. So compared to the Candid Coral, you could tell that... There's the Candid Coral and there's Orgasm. Um, orgasm is more pink and Candid Coral is more corally, like more orangey. But they're really similar. And I love NARS Orgasm. I have it on right now. It's really, really pretty. Another favorite blush brand that I have like for spring and not even just spring, like all over, like all year round, is Benefit. And I love their blushes. Um, my holy grail bronzer is Hula, so I'm just getting out of topic, but I love Benefit box powders. Um, the one that I really like for spring is um, Benefit's Hervana, and it's going to be like a light pink color. My sister uses this all the time, and it's really, really pretty. It has like purple, orange, and pink, and white, and when you swirl it together, you get a nice light pink color it's right here can't really tell and then my last blush that i have is by the brand benefit and it's also it's called dandelion and so many people use this as a setting powder because it's really light but you can use it for like those days that you don't want to wear much makeup and it's like a light light pink color and it's really, really sheer, and it just gives you, like, a put-together look. It reminds me, it's in the middle finger, it reminds me of Nars's Deep Throat Blush. And, yeah, you guys, those are all my spring blushes. As you can tell, they're more on the pinky, curly side. And I also have the bronzy color by Lorac. Hopefully, some of these blushes um, 
catch your eye and maybe you go try them out and yeah thank you guys so much for watching and i'll speak to you guys pretty soon bye